Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you guys for tuning in so far to this video. Today's video is going to be what's in my six month old baby changing bag or diaper bag, however you call it. If you wanna see what is in my son's changing bag, then definitely stay tuned. So I changed my bag. I don't know if you watch what's in my baby's hospital bag. It was like a gray backpack. I used that up until my son turned six months and then I changed to get this bag. This is the Skip Hop. I can't remember the name of the bag, but it's from Skip Hop. It's a gray and black, like duffel handbag type of style. And the reason why I changed from the backpack is because I felt like the backpack was too small for all of my son's needs. He's getting older and getting bigger and requiring a lot more things from when he was a newborn. So um, yes, I changed my bag. Plus I got bored of having a backpack. I know it's more practical. That's my son in the background. Um, I know it is more practical to have a backpack, but yeah, I got bored. So I changed it up. I got this bag off um, a website called Bounty. They send me a lot of um, offers. This bag, I think originally was like 60 something pounds, but I got it on offer for 15 pounds. So I'm really happy about that. And I like the fact that it is really big and can literally fit everything I need for my son. So I'm just gonna get right into it. Here you go, Baba. I'm going to get right into it and kind of like pull things out and then put them back into place because I don't want to ruin it. But on the outskirts, it's got like um, two big pockets on each side. I might do a cutaway of it for you guys. So it's got those two and then it's got these two hooks on the side so I can hook it onto the stroller, buggy, whatever you want to call it. And then it's got a zipped pocket here at the front and then an open pocket at the back where I store the changing mat it comes with. It's just a plain black skip hop changing mat with the skip hop sign which I really like because obviously some changing stations and toilets are absolutely filthy. If I'm out like in a shopping centre or something, I try to go to like the allocated baby changing room sections and things because that's a lot more cleaner than going into a disabled toilet to then use the folded down changing um, thing. Um, so yeah, that's that. On one side of the big pocket here, I keep my wallet, so I've got two. I've got this that holds in all my cash and cards. Yeah. And then I've got my coin purse. And I keep them here because it's just easier to access. Um, and I don't mind keeping it here because it's the pockets are really big and quite deep. So it's not really, I don't know. I do sometimes pop it inside the bag. Now I'm gonna do a cutaway and show you what the bag looks like inside because um, I can't show it to you properly, but I will do a cutaway. Anyway, to start on the inside zip, I have the Milton 30 antibacterial surface wipes. I use this to clean all his toys every time because Josiah has a habit of chucking toys on the floor when we're out. Now in front of the, that zip, I have a flask that I keep hot water in. I also have another one that I put cooled kettle water in that flask as well, but I don't take that one with me. Um, I keep in the pocket a small water bottle, um, and this has obviously got cooled kettled water in it. In the other slot, I keep a tub of his baby milk powder, and this is seven scoops of the powder um, to seven ounces, obviously, of water. Yeah. 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 I usually do make my own food for my son and I do have 
my own um, pouch station. He's trying to crawl over to me. <laughs> my pouch station, but on my lazy days when I've run out of the food that I've made for him, I like to buy Ella's Kitchen because it's 100% organic. They don't put anything else in it. So I would either take the food that I've made in the pouches or take Ella's Kitchen food out with me. Because obviously now he's six months, he's eating a lot more solids and reducing the milk that he's having. So he is having, are you crawling? Are you coming to mummy? Hey? When you get here, I'll show you to everybody, okay? <laughs> um, what was I saying? Um, yeah, so I take a pouch out with me because now he's having three solid meals a day and three bottles of water. Um, three bottles of milk after each solid he has a little bit of water as well and he also um has pudding after his lunch and dinner um i am going to do a what my six month old baby eats in a day video so if you definitely want that thumbs up and comment below so i know that you want that the bag also came with like a little like pouch kind of thing so yes this is the pouch um this is what i call the mum pouch because um this is basically where i keep all my stuff and also stuff for josiah so in here i've got my medication josiah no you're gonna fall if you do that you're going to fall so in here i have my medication that i take regularly i have um saline nasal sprays for josiah I have Bongello, which I barely use for him now because I realise that actually irritates him more. I have teething powders, but they've run out and I prefer the teething powders. I have hand sanitizer. I have African Chocho cream, which I use on his skin at times because he's got very um, dry skin on his face um, and baby eczema. And then that's pretty much it. I always keep a pen because you never know when you're going to need a pen. So that's pretty much it in here. Um, then I have his bottle warmer that has a spare clean bottle in there. I have some books that I will take just in case we go out and I need to eat or wherever we are and he's bored and I need to entertain him. I've got a stack of books here which are like Dear Zoo Library. So it's got like a book of wild animals, numbers, pets and colours. I've got some teething ring toys for him. I had his Sophie the giraffe toy actually. It's in the front pouch. I've got some more teething toys for him. Sophie the giraffe and like a regular toy. Do you want this now? Sophie the giraffe is literally like his favourite toy. <laughs> So I keep that in, I keep the Sophie the Giraffe one in the front pouch because it's easier to access because I know it's his favourite one. I have this toy which is meant to hang on his activity gym but I just took it off because he really likes this toy. I have his hat and I have his wipes which I use is the Pampers Aqua Pure wipes and I also use the Pampers Aqua Pure nappies or diapers however you want to say he's currently size five i take between three and four with me when we're going out then i have this clear pouch which has also mum essentials which i'm gonna actually transfer into the other pouch but in here it has hand wash hand sanitizer it has um hand cream and it had mosquito repellent and um, toilet spray because this is pretty much what I used when I went to Ghana but I've not taken those stuff out but that's still in here I haven't got them in here right now but I also put bibs maybe three or four bibs in there because they get dirty very quickly I also put some spare clothes in there depending on how long we're going to be out um, because he might smear food all over his clothes especially if he's ill or something I might put some spare clothes just in case he has a poop explosion or spits up and vomits all over his clothes um sometimes especially when he's ill if he's not ill i don't bother but um i put cow in here as well 
and obviously like I said his teeth and powder and things like that um, I am actually going to start putting in the mum pouch um, like mini first aid stuff especially now that he's always trying to crawl and stuff just in case he does anything yes I'm talking about you just in case he does anything to hurt himself at least I've got the things I need to sort him out so that's pretty much it in Josiah's baby bag changing bag oh on this side of the pouch I've got more toys for him and also I've got a pot of baby rice that I might put in his milk if I feel like okay he's not had enough of his solids and I need something a bit thicker than just milk to give him to like obviously fill him up then I'll put some baby rice in his milk for him because this boy loves his food but sometimes he acts up and wherever we are he might not want to eat his solid food so that's like an alternative so that's pretty much it and what's in my diaper bag or in Josiah's changing bag, so diaper bag, I should say. Also, on days when I need to pop out real quick, like going to do shopping for the house, like food shop, or going for a walk in the park, or going to like one of his mother and baby groups, which is close by, whatever the case is, if I'm gonna be out for, let's say, an hour, maybe, only, then the only things I will take is this Skip Hop um, changing mat, which I got from Amazon. It is like, it opens up like this and, yes, okay, so I don't put it down from there. It opens up like this for a changing mat. It has a zip pocket here where you can put nappies. And then what I do is in this section here, I would put his wipes. Yes, son. Wait, 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 wait. It also has like a front section here if I want to put my phone or whatever in there. So I use this. I'll put the link to this below. And if I can find the link to the bag, I'll put it below as well. And then I'll take his bottle warmer with pre-made milk already in the bottle. And it's going to be hot and obviously cool down over time. So I will take this and that's pretty much it. Because sometimes it's a bit of a hassle to take go out when you need to run a quick errand. And then have to take the baby out, put him on the buggy, take the bag, clip the bag on the buggy. Then go and do what you need to do and take It's just long. So sometimes it's just quick to take this. It can click onto the buggy from here. And then this obviously has a thingy bob so I can pop that on here on the buggy as well and I'm good to go I don't have to worry about taking so many things with me I will probably take a toy with me as well and put it in like on the side of the car seat when he's on the buggy or whatnot 